విదేశాల్లో ఎంబీబీఎస్ హైదరాబాద్ లోని సొంత ఆఫీసే కేంద్రంగా పనిచేసే మెడికో అబ్రాడ్ సంస్థ గత పదిహేను సంవత్సరాలుగా వందలాది విద్యార్థుల డాక్టర్ కళలను నిజం చేస్తూ మధ్యతరగతి ఆదాయ వర్గాల బడ్జెట్ కు అనుగుణమైన విదేశీ యూనివర్సిటీలను ఎంపిక చేస్తుంది thought of going to uh, Belarus University for studying over there. What doubts did you have and did all they get clarified now? Yeah, I hope. Yeah, it's clarified. Like, What uh, doubts did you have? I had, uh, you know, about the adjustment over there. We have, you know, minus 20, minus 10 degrees Celsius mm. and uh, about food. We normally, you know, boys, we don't know how to cook. And, uh, you know, the stuffs, all the vegetables we get here, like, you know, the gobi and the other stuff, we don't get here, we get there. And over there, it's a bit costly. Mm. So we need to manage it. And the, the other, like, tomato is, you know, it's very essential for cooking. Mm. So it's a bit costly. You need to manage these things and all. And uh, I was basically worried about how the knowledge will I get. Mm. Compared to in India, we have the best faculties. Mm. You know, okay, India is the top most uh, in studies. Mm. I, I, I agree with that. But mm. Gomer is also not behind. Okay, mm. we have good good teachers, good mm. facilities, good uh, halls, lecture halls, good teachers, mm. and uh, you know, good. We have cadavers, mm. the, the dead body, and okay. all. Okay, so tell us about your faculty, Aziz. Uh, do they help you in everything, in practicals, in subject? If you have any doubts, do they clear? Definitely, ma'am. The teachers, you know, they help. You know, uh, about uh, more more than than they reach. Mm. They do more than they reach. They help us, they guide us, you know, if we have some questions, we ask them, and sometimes we can call them, mm. you know, I, I did in anatomy sometimes, so mm. if we study, we can have good uh, knowledge in anatomy, mm. it's not that we are not studying in India, we don't have that knowledge, and we will not be accepted in India, it's not like that, mm. I felt that, okay, I can also have a good knowledge, and after coming here, I can do internship, I can get more knowledge, and you know, I can cope up the Indian students, okay. my, my brother is in fourth year mm. MBBS, so like i used to think he will be better than me now i think no i can also be like him mm. or sometimes more than him mm. so clinicals are good teachers are best and it's on you how you study mm. that's all i can say about the fa faculties and on your, yourself okay so what major difference did you find uh, in indian education mbbs in india and mbbs in uh, belarus uh, gomel state university here you know we have more pressure on the students there we don't have that pressure because you know we are foreign students and uh, no one is gu guiding us mm. here you know parents are ba behind us mm. study you need to study like uh, our dad will ask okay you are getting uh, bad marks you need to study you need to cope up with the percentage and all with the other students but there no one is there so you need to have the internal you know one uh, that agenda zeal. that zeal that agenda that i need to get uh, 75 or distinction or 80 or 90 or mm. we have some uh, uh, skipping exam things called Afsama. So we need to get those things and all and be in the front of Dean in, in her names, you know, they you, they will call us and all these things. So it's quite on us only. Okay. We should, uh, I mean, cope up all the things. Okay, so where you be able to cope up with the uh, academics over there? I mean, you know, Indian education system is entirely different. Yes, yes. And there you have different education system. Yes. So where you be able to cope up with their academics? Well, you want me to tell the differences. Yeah. In India, we have a lot good fac faculty members, good teachers. We have good. We have a lot of cadavers, and uh, we can go to clinicals. We have more knowledge here. But okay, there we have also, and we need to be forward. We need to go forward. We need to go attend. We need to study. In fact, you can cope up. It's nothing like that. Yeah. It's on yourself. I, I, okay, I, I nearly cope up. You know, okay. I nearly did that. I yeah. nearly studied everything. So. What kind of problems? I mean, did you ever face any problem living in Belarus and studying over there? Did you face any kind of racism over there? Racism? No, never ma'am. I didn't feel because those people are very calm, peaceful people. And uh, they, they don't like any war or any thing, type of, you know, fights and all. So they are good people. Even with my fellow mates, I never felt uh, racism. Like, uh, I have, we are just two Muslim friends and the others are Hindu. We never uh, faced any, you know, Hindu Muslim. Mm. Uh, okay, sometimes in India we have, but still, we should think beyond. Mm. We should have unity between us mm. so that, you know, we can go at higher level. We can be like America or the other countries. So we should have some unities in us. Mm. I never felt the racism in religion nor any foreign thing. Okay. I never had those things. Vidyarthula Bangaru Bhavishatu Tirchi Didendukum Sarayna University, Sarayna Consultancy Empika, Yento Mukhyam.
తక్కువ ఖర్చుతో క్వాలిటీ ఎడ్యుకేషన్ అందిస్తున్న విదేశీ మెడికల్ అడ్మిషన్ ల స్పెషలిస్ట్ మెడికో అబ్రాడ్ బెలారూస్ లో ఎంబీబీఎస్ అద్వితీయ ప్రమాణాలు ఇండియన్ ఎంబసీచే ధృవీకరించబడ్డ సేఫ్టీ భారతీయ విద్యార్థులను ఆకర్షిస్తున్న గోమెల్ యూనివర్సిటీ సరైన యూనివర్సిటీ సరైన కన్సల్టెన్సీల ఎంపిక ముఖ్యం మెడికో అబ్రాడ్ డబల్ నైన్ ఫైవ్ నైన్ డబల్ వన్ ఫోర్ ఫైవ్ ఫోర్ ఫ